A Fairfax County woman reached out to us telling us that she's seen dozens of crashes on her street and now she wants something done about it. So our Evan Kosloff met up with her today and has this story. Our mailbox down at that point. <laughs> Debbie Gerald is looking through an old photo album, not of friends or family, but of old crash photos by her home on Lincolnia Road in the Alexandria area. The cars have been running off this road for as long as I can remember. In fact, it was a couple weeks ago when there was yet another crash that hit very close to home. We woke up to a loud noise and there was a car in our front yard that could easily have happened while my 84 year old mother is out cutting grass in the front yard. And this mother daughter duo has been trying to bring attention to this problem. Debbie, who's a fire photographer in her free time, has started taking photos of crashes in the neighborhood and her mom has started a meticulous list. By their count, there were 27 crashes on this stretch of road in 2022 and already this year, they've seen 15 crashes. So the first one was a car into a wood fence. May 31st, a box truck ran off the road. June 6th, the signs were hit overnight. June 24th, there was a three car accident. June 30th, a truck ran off and hit our mailbox. And July 1st, the car ran off the route at 2.30 a.m. into the bushes. And because of all these crashes happening right here on this stretch of road, Debbie has reached out to the Virginia Department of Transportation, asking them to lower the speed limit from 35 miles per hour. But so far, VDOT has said no, telling us in a statement that a speed limit study was conducted for the area and quote, based on the findings of the study, the recommendation was to maintain the speed limit. That answer has not sat well for Debbie or her mom who say they're gonna keep fighting for changes. We you know, are concerned about our neighbors. We're concerned about the amount of damage that's been done to cars. In Northern Virginia, I'm Evan Kozloff, WUSA 9. So again, if you've got a story that needs attention, you can text us about it. You can text us at 202-895-5599.